for only I'm um, for future season surprise. And today, Mickey, you get your moment. <laughs> you get your moment at last to basically just <laughs> Oh, I've been waiting for this. I really have. <laughs> you have. Because, um... On the last couple of months, Mickey's been saying about how, really, this, um... expansion really should have been something for a third park. Um... It should have been, you know... That's what it should have been instead. It should have been a third park rather than just expanding the studios. Um, yeah. So I've been promising we would cover that in a um, potential um, opinion village. And that is what we're going to be doing today. So, yep. I will see you making. Yeah. Because. A lot of people don't know we are actually legally con con obliged to make a third park by the time you turn 40. Well, that's something to look forward to. <laughs> but no, we are technically contractually obliged to have a third theme park built by the time you turn 40 in 2036. Yeah, otherwise we, I believe, lose that land. Yeah, if we don't hit that legal obligation then we do lose that land and so anyone could purchase that right the right to that land for the first for the first park mm -hmm. well yeah i i i I, I think i remember reading that somewhere but i just can't remember um where it was um sorry just i could, I could tell you guys were sort of um hovering falling off so uh <laughs> okay. Uh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. We are. So yeah. Um, you would say you. Could, yeah, I had, I had read it somewhere. Um, a couple of years ago that, that um. You guys are. Contractually obliged to. Uh, make a third a third theme park, but I just, but of course, because, Paz never really confirmed that. Yeah. Um. It's kind of been something, you know, as idle gossip among, among the fan base. Well, would you really want to announce something that is 30, 13 years in a box? Well, the American Parks probably would. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah. The American Parks would have no problem doing that. But... Uh, just, oh, I don't know. Let's go back to how far... Final bonds between each park opening in Paris was it announced? Oh, I don't know. Not worth thinking. But no. Um. Yeah, but I don't remember reading, reading about it somewhere, but I can't remember where. Um. But yeah, but yeah. So we, so we, we are legally obliged to make a third theme park by the time you hit forty. Otherwise, we definitely will lose that land. Okay. So you've been saying that this expand the WDS two expansion, which of course was first announced back in twenty eighteen, it so far hasn't really lived up to it to the hype that it promised. Uh, but you could argue external factors, external factors, external factors. You can argue that, um, and also French labour work, labour men. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're not out of the woods completely, yeah. Um, but no, you kind of felt this really should have been a third theme park. Where did you have those first sort of inklings? Well, I think it was not long after Avengers Campus have opened, so I mean, it's, it's been a good sort of 18 months that I've been feeling now. This really wasn't a good idea. It wasn't a good I mean, yeah, I mean, God knows at, um, that we are deemed the black sheep of the theme parks. Yeah. There was always money on the socials about how, how years in Paris had a new attraction, da 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 the name park now can't have one probably for 30 years. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I da 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 But um, but no, I mean, as George has constantly said time and time and time again, Studios Park had a good feed. It really did. 
the Shearer's part where it first opened in 2002 had a really, really um, good theme. But of course, slowly, bit by bit by bit, um, your home has sort of, over the last sort of eight years, that has completely just chipped away bit by bit by bit by bit. And of course, now it's now fully gone. Because we did cover that while Mickey was on paternity, uh, the signs were being, those studio signs uh, were being were being covered up. Oh yeah, we did cover that. You get, you're up. Yeah, they've been pa they've been paid a lot. So when you go in November, if you in a few uh, in November, mm -hmm, when you go, um, you'll notice all the studio signs will be now covered up, covered up. Mm -hmm. So technically, the studio's theme is now technically dead. And you just got show but you just got show building to house various rides and shows because. There was one Crash's Coaster. Oh yeah, it wasn't Crash's Coaster Studio 5. I think it was. I can't remember all the num all the numbers. I know I might think was Studio 3. Yeah. Uh, I can't remember them all, but yeah, Crash's Coaster I believe, yeah, was Studio 5. I remember it's early days. You'd see that number there going, what is that doing there? <laughs> <laughs> of course, Crush's Coast was one of the first new attractions to be built alongside Cars, Catchers, Rioli, so it just... But anyway, yeah. Um, but, no, but that fee is, is pretty much now well and truly gone. It's, it's, it's dead. That fee is no longer existent. So, um, yeah. But it just... But having heard from YouTube about Avengers Campus, it just feels like now that... Well, these lands just don't really feel like they should be there. It kind of makes it feel like we're going, we're going to put three... No, not three. Two lands! <laughs> we could still do a third land. Yeah, but I'll just for argument's sake. We've got at least two, maybe three lands going in. But they don't really sort of connect. Nah. I mean, it just... It's going to make you feel like in when we get into the 2030s, when this is going to probably most likely be finished. Yeah. It's going to be like, well, what was the point in all of this? Yeah, it, it just feels like they're completely out of place. Yeah, given how... I don't know if it's going to be any case the production courtyard. Because that will feel completely out of place if it's done there. Mm -hmm. you know, it just feels, feels completely weird. Yeah. Um, so really, and given how tiny Avengers Campus is in Paris... Oh, it's really small. It's really, it really, it really... You just think, well... What the fuck? And that is where I got these, got the, got those growing pains that I got last year, which we have covered, covered a, a, a separate video on that. I just felt with Walking Dead Campus, I was thinking, is that it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, we were like, is that it? Is this really what a portion of two of two billion euros looks like? So it is. Then. That's giving me very worrying signs for Frozen Land in what was mm -hmm. But um Yeah, so Yeah, yeah but but it's kind of it is quite tiny. It's only got two rides. One a car one is a carbon copy from DCA, the other is a refeed of Rock and Roller Coaster. You've got two restaurants. A meet and greet area, and uh, that's about it. And a, sh and a shop. Oh, the shop. Yeah, but that's about it. Nah, it's quite small, and that's giving me the growing concerns of and these growing pains that I've had for the last year. Of, well, that's what a Avengers Campus is gonna look like. Can you imagine, in, say, what two? If say two years, t maybe next year or two years time. It more likely will be two years time, Josh. No! What are you going to be an Arundel now? It more likely will be two years. Okay, well, let's say two years time when Frozen opens. Is that going to be what we simply get with Frozen Land? I just don't know. Yeah. But that's why this, this, these lands, so Marvel, Frozen, Star Wars, need to have been in a third park because you could expand more on that. Absolutely. You could expand further. Um, and you could have... Would you still have the lake in the third park? Yeah. So that would be, be the part of the lake. We're getting, a, we're, we're getting a lake whether you like it or not. 
He does not want the lake. <laughs> we don't need a fucking lake. <laughs> it's not at cots. <laughs> We're not the American parks. Yeah, they've got all this lovely space. You can just walk away. It's a plump like that. But no, nah, nah, he's not. He does not want the lake. But no, we gave one, whether you like it or not. But could that not go in the third part, then? Yeah. So the third part be what I have to like him. So what I'm suggesting is, you should have left Studios Park as it is, and either spruce it, use the two billion euros to spruce it up, or put new attractions in. Yeah, put new attractions, yeah. Yeah. And then you build a completely third park, and that's where you put Marvel. That's where you put Frozen. That's where you put Star Wars. That's where you put the lake. That's... Wait. Because really now, I think what we've learned from Avengers Campus is 2 billion euros is not enough to do a multi-park expansion. Uh, especially the, the backdrop of, of today's climate. Not we knew that at the time. Well, yeah. But, um... Yeah, because clearly with this with expansion, the idea, the template is for each land is you're going to get just two attractions. One's an e-ticket, the other's a small ticket item. But what is really a better campus is e-ticket? Because it's not, because it's not web slingers. And it certainly is not Flight Force. Because that went down like a lead balloon. Yep. Well, I don't think we've got any ticket there. No. Nah. I think people would try and argue that Flight Force is, is the e-ticket. But, I don't, but, 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 but can you really call a refoom attraction of an e-ticket? It's your home. <laughs> oh, well, right. Yeah, it's your home, but, yeah. So, yeah, so you would rather, Mickey, would have rather this expansion and now it's by 2018, it should have been a third lot park. Yeah. That is what they probably should have announced back in 2018. The third, they should have announced, right, this third park that we are legally committed, obliged to, okay, we, this is what, this is our plans for it. We're going to do a Marble Land, we're going to do a Frozen Land, and we're going to do a Star Wars Land, and the centre of it will be a great big lake. That is what they should have, should have announced. Yeah, but three parks alone... Sorry, no, not three parks. Three lands alone is not enough for a theme park. Okay. Well, then, what would you want to put in as well? What would you want to put in? And how many lands have we cut off? That's a good... That is a good, good point. Can I just bring this bit back? Because it, it does look like they're slanting off. It really does. Sorry, don't know where. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. No, that's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry about my chair. As long as you guys are close and sure and don't slide, it's fine. Um, that's a good question, Cut, because they could put out how many lines would you have? Because there's not really a set um, structure of how many lines you could put in. Um, and, and, and this, uh, this actually may be something we should maybe do for another time. It should, fine. Yeah, yeah. This should, this actually should maybe be a separate video. What other lands would we put in in a third in a third park? Because I've got one. I don't, want to, I don't want to say it now because I don't think it's the right time and place but I've got one I can think of mm -hmm. I, I've got I've got one we know what one you've got <laughs> and you can't have it because of the weather <laughs> you can't have cars land because of the weather it's not it's not allowed you've learnt alright <laughs> We've learnt this already. We've covered that. You can't have cars, land. Deal with it. <laughs> um. Well, he could, but he can't have Radio Springs races. Mm. Oh, yeah. He, he, he could, but it would have to be more like a ride similar to what you have in Toy Story Playland. Yeah. Then the big e-ticket that we got in CCA. Yeah. yeah, but he was Radio Springs racers. But you can't have it! <laughs> Ugh, a dog can dream. Yeah, he can dream bit. Dream it, ain't gay it. <laughs> we might be going back there one day. You never know. 
I, I'm, I'm, I'm close to the idea of the 30th. So, you know, so we, we might be going back. <laughs> you never know. But, uh, you know, I'm talking about being closer to home. <laughs> if we had a theme park here, could do it. Because of, cause of given how we now seem to have massive heat waves here in England. So. <laughs> Although I don't think Disneyland London is something that's going to cover that 60 billion, is it? No, no, but uh, <laughs> no, but that is probably going to be going to be it for a separate video. So you guys come back on and that. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So you, that, but that's why I think it should have been. It should have been 20. Right. We're going to do this third theme park, and we're going to put marble in. We're going to put frozen in. We're going to put Star Wars in. We're going to put the lake in, and we're going to put the other lands in as well. But we haven't decided on what those are, are yet, because let's face it, it's probably going to take us, what, 10, 15 years to build it. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's what it should have done. And then, and then it's a com complete commitment to this bird park, because people do know about it, the fans do know about it. Yeah. But it's never been officially c confirmed that we have to have a third park by da 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 yeah, I, I keep trying to look up to see where I can find it. So I've got um, got um, Google open to see if I can try and find the Today Show. Even though we don't need the internet for Today Show, I thought I can try and look it up. That's been up. But I can't seem to find where it is that said that we have to do this by da da da. Right. So. Oh, oh God. So, just run that by me again. If we don't... What is it? What is it doing? Oh, my God. Oh, my. Uh, so, run again. If we don't hit that target, we lose the land. Yeah. Very simple. Yeah. If we don't hit that... That deadline, then we lose the rights to that land, and anyone could basically take it, which would not be good because the last because the last thing you'd want is somebody to um, to take uh, what could be a decent land for yeah for your park yeah you don't because somebody could build build something. Mm -hmm. That could be direct competition, and that's the last thing we need. Yeah. But, but what we've seen so far is that these lands that are going to be added to Walt Disney Studios Park are very, very small. Yeah. But really, that does not then make Studios Park an all-day park, which is what they want it to be now. Because let's face it, a bed is campus with us, there is, there is nothing in there to cater for us. Nope. Well, we only went in it last year because we were doing, because obviously we agreed that with each new part that expands open, we go and wreck it. That's what we agreed. So we only went in it last year to wreck it, and me was like, oh no, no. Yeah, this is, this is, um, it's not really impressive, is it? No, 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 no. But uh, I agree. I think we're just we're just gonna end up with very small lands, and that and that's gonna be like, well, what was the point? And it will be like, what was the point? Yeah. What what was the point? You you had two billion euros to give us three stunning lands based on three e big e ticket IPs. Yeah. And now here's the reality. But it'd be a good thing to do, wouldn't it? When it's this whole thing turned up, we get to do a comparison video of then and of then and now, because obviously back then was all this, and and now it's like, well, here you go, it's just that. There you go. Made the made the jigsaw worse. Yeah, absolutely made that jigsaw worse. I'm willing to bet you a hundred. I'm willing to bet you big euros that the bulk of that TV is going on the lake. Really? Yeah. I'm waiting to bet big bucks. 
Right, yeah. And what do we need it for? Nothing! We've not got the space. Well, we don't have the perimeters to cope for guest flow and a great big whopping lake. Which is gonna do what exactly? World of colour? We don't need that, you can go in the protection on the on the main castle. Plus we won't have any reason surrounding areas to do our birds fantastic either. Not that we want to, after what happened in D in DC uh, in Disneyland. Yep, 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 yep. I mean the fire I mean the flame effects are only just returning back to Disney Dream. Yeah. Only one side though. Well, yeah, only one side. They have, a, they have returned, but it's only on, currently, currently only on one side, so only one side is working. I don't know. Yeah, yeah so... But yeah. But for me, this expansion really, it, it, it's just now going down like a lead balloon. It's like, you sold us something good, but you haven't been able to deliver so far. And you can maybe say, well, yeah, our guests are good. It, it's increased guest flow a bit. But that's because people are interested to see what it's all about. Yeah. Exactly. But, like, but apart from that, you've got nothing else to sell it. Yeah. Plus, are we even going to have a third land? Are we not going to have a third land? Exactly. So you can't even commit to that. It's like... We all know that something's up with that third land, so why can't you just tell us that's what's going on? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Plus, let's not forget that also with Frozen Land, there's also going to be a replica of Elsa's cast up Ice Palace. Well, how much is that going to take up? Because remember, we're, we're going to be, in a few years' time, we are going to be the envy of the resort, because look at us, we've got two castles. Because currently, Shanghai can boast, it may be the youngest of the family, but it can boast that it's got the biggest castle. Well, in a few years' time, we can be the enemy for the resort by saying, look at us, we've got two castles. Mm -hmm. But, um, but really, that's, I just strongly feel, it feel this expansion is not helping Studios Park, it should. It's just not. Well, because the layout, and they and, and the Imagineers have admitted this, the layout of the whole park didn't work out well. Not, it did not work. But you spend 21 years now bashing the layout, what have you done to fix it? Nothing. Hmm? Nothing. Look at production court. Look at production court. Look at production courtyard. That is a massive courtyard, massive space. And for what? It's still gonna look like a great big eye saw that it's all done because, yeah, because you'll be able to see the distance, the expansion area, and that's supposed to all look pretty. But you've got this great big massive production courtyard. It's like, well, it just looked like an eye saw. You know what it has? And no one's gonna be able to determine what is actually properly in production courtyard. It's just a great big mess. It would be a lot better, as we've already called it, it would be a lot better to use the two billion euros to spruce the park up, fix things apart that don't work, and, as many said, the third third park, that's been DC man. But, but it's just been, it's not living up to what, what we expected. Now, I don't know if, that, if that's because the reality is hit, hit has creeped in, external factors have, hit, have creeped in, I don't know, but it's not worked. It's not working, and it's only going to get worse. Yeah, that's the song. Old song goes: things can they get better? Or no, not in this occasion. <laughs> Were you afraid it's the big could deeply radiant episode? Yep. <laughs> and Jody said, says it. Liz Bush opens the door to Frank, and Frank comes into his show, and then Jody's like, "Or oh, not?" <laughs> but he gave us a good revelation. I was shocked when he gave that revelation. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, um. Oh, well. But, anyway. But, um, yeah, I. I but, no, I, 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 I just think it would have been a lot better if you just said, right, we're going to do a. We're going to do that third part we are constantly saying we are or not going to do. We're going to do it. 
this is what we're going to do. Um, and we aim to have it built by da 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 da. Yeah. That's what should have been done. Um, now, to me, it's right. Those three pop lands alone are not enough. But, like George said, we can discuss that another time. Yeah. Absolutely, 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 absolutely not hard. But as far as I'm concerned, I'm done. I'm done. I just feel it was a waste. It's, it's a complete stupid idea. You should have done it as a, as a new park, not as expansion to land. Because let's face it, it's just three random IPs dropped in. Yeah. Um, just make the jigsaw the more bigger jigsaw. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Right. That is all for today's show. Thank you so much for joining us. If you loved it, do click the like button. If not, subscribe to our channel. Carol, man, you click the subscribe button. That way, you will never see someone when you click the link to a virtual park or payment. You can realize that kind of my official YouTube channel. Until next time, I'll see you next time. Merci, guys. I'm just going to talk about it. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.